What's up, Leo? How's it going? I hope everybody's having a great day. We are going to get right into your reading. Um, it's going to be a timeless love reading, so take what resonates. You know to never force anything to fit. Um, it is a general reading, but I do make it as personal as possible, so I'm going to pull from multiple decks, so stick around to the end. For those of you that are brand new to my channel, I am so grateful you're here. My name is Sam. Go ahead and subscribe so you can get the notifications of all the readings I post daily, but also so you can take part in my monthly giveaways. I am giving away two free personal readings this month um, for September 2024. So with that being said, new and returning subscribers, go ahead and leave the word fall down below or something fallish as an emoji. Um, I know for those of you in the Southern Hemisphere, you are entering into spring, but for me, it's the Northern Hemisphere. My birthday's within the Northern, or within the fall, the autumn time. It's my favorite season, so let's embrace it and just, you know, do something fallish for this giveaway. At the end of the month, and I do this each and every month, I will randomly choose those people to win the giveaways. Um, and I'll always remind you to check your notifications the very last weekend of the month. Little bell, top right hand corner of everyone's YouTube homepage. Two people will be hearing from me at the end of the month. Past life connection. Soulmate connection. Two people feeling an intense bond because you were together in previous lifetimes. Dark male, dark, darker skin, dark hair. For those of you that resonates, union is coming. You with someone very special. All right, let's get one more card. Karma, karma in your favor. All right. You may have dark hair, dark skin. You might be very tan right now because for those of us in the Northern Hemisphere, we're coming out of summer or might even be using a tanning booth. We have grow old love. You know what this reminds me of every time this comes out is Up. The Disney movie Up, growing old with one another. You know, that movie where they both, there's, you know, their favorite house, the one they bought together, they remodeled together, and it's like they sit on their chairs beside one another holding each other's hand. So growing old type of love, and then look at this, lost and found love. I feel a shifting in the wheel, the divinely guided wheel, opening that door, positive karma, coming in for you and this person. All right, let's see what else we can get. Karmic lesson. So Spirit is coming through in this moment, Leo, saying all karma is paid in full. Anything that you have needed to pay back in terms of karma, and we all have it. None of us are perfect. We all have karma to pay back. Even from a past lifetime, do we have karma? So I, I feel that between you and this person and the previous lifetimes that you've had, that there is karma that needed to be paid back and it is paid in full. This is a cycle being completely closed out for you to come into union with someone. Infidelity, fling, emotional affair, texting. So with that coming out for some of you, you have very strong temptation, strong soul bond with someone that you're either attached to someone else or they may be. There's union twice. And then should I stay or should I go? All right. It's almost like the energy has been closed off. The gate has been closed. The lock has been locked, but I feel it's opening. 
let's see. For my Leo spirit. We've got union coming in twice. Leo's energy. And the person showing up in Leo's reading. Thank you. The full. You're ready. You're ready to take a leap of faith. You might be going back and forth with, should I keep this faith? Should I, um, you know, continue to allow myself to think about this person or hold hope for this connection? But I do feel that they, they want union. You want union. You know it's something undeniable. The hermit. This person is doing a lot of soul searching. But look at how this came out. See how this is your energy and this is your person's energy? Do you see how this person is looking beyond their shoulder? It's almost like eyeing you up, wondering how you're doing. I feel like this person is heavily thinking about you. We have two major arcana right there. Spare what will be the overall outcome for Leo and this soul union. The sun. Three major arcana. And the high priestess. Guys, I feel for some of you, this might even be um, your spouse, your partner. Not for all of you. Your spouse, your partner. There might have been some infidelity. You know, you may be working on or speaking of healing the relationship here, healing the marriage. And I do see that coming in that situation. I feel this person was divinely placed in your life, though. There is someone returning that you have experienced multiple past lifetimes with. The Page of Cups, there's the good news, there's the communication. Yeah, this person is receiving an aha moment. I feel that they are ready to do and sacrifice whatever they need to do to show you how serious they are about this union. Page of Coins. Children may be involved. You may have children. They may be. As I stated, this could be a marriage of infidelity. And the two of you are talking about healing and, you know, rekindling. You may have children with one another. Nine of Swords. Ace of Wands. Yes, yeah, Spirit is saying there is no need to worry. Yes, it was a hard ending. There, this was an ending that needed to occur. But I do see forward movement. I do see a future where both of you are together. All right, let's see what else. Look at this. This card doesn't even belong in this deck. How synchronistic is that? The Emperor. And look at that. The dark male. Hmm. For some of you, soulmate, possibly twin flame, divine masculine energy here. You may be dealing with a fellow fire sign or maybe an Aries. We also have Virgo energy here. Pisces, Cancer Scorpio. And then we have Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. All right, before I clarify this, let me say, Spirit, why is union here twice? Why has union showed up twice? There is definitely going to be a reunion, Leo. There is regrets. Clarifying union coming in twice. Now a reunion with that soul tie. Past lifetime, you are kindred spirits rekindling this connection in this lifetime. And as I stated, this person will do whatever it takes 
to make up for where, where the things went the wrong way. All right, Spirit, please clarify additionally between Neo and this person coming through. Ace of Cups. So we have the Ace of Cups and the Ace of Wands. I do feel long-term commitment here. I feel balancing out the scales for some of you coming into union, marrying one another, or like I said, healing the marriage that you may already have. But bringing balance to this connection, making it fair. This person is manifesting you, Leah. Manifesting you. The fool twice. And the six of wands. Let's see. Spirit, why is the fool twice here? There it is. Wanting to take a leap of faith. It's faded. You know in your intuition that you haven't been able to shake this person. That's why you're listening to this reading. They have not been able to shake you. There's a reason. It's something that goes way beyond this lifetime. You connect with this person deeply within your heart and your soul. It was fated for the two of you to meet in this lifetime. And Spirit, please clarify the Emperor and the Dark Male. The Emperor and the Dark Male. Soulmate energy. Divine masculine energy. Finding each other equally attractive. Such a strong temptation. Your yin, it's like yin and yang. Your yin to their yang. And I just heard your peanut butter and jelly. Or my lobster. From the notebook. This is definitely an intense... intense connection and this person wants to grow old with you leo it may have been lost for a brief moment even maybe longer than a brief moment maybe a year or more but what was lost here is now found and I feel the moment that this karma is positive for both of you to reunite. It will go the distance. So I've got to say, for those of you that it's resonating and you're, you're thinking, should I hold out hope? Should I stay or should I go? Is there a chance? Why do I feel such a strong bond to this person? This is the confirmation you need. E A T I K G C N O R M Rest or repeats. So do take what resonates, leave the word um, fall or something fallish down below in the comment section. Anytime you want me to tune into Just Your Energy Leo, click on the link in the description box. It'll take you right over to my Etsy shop. There it's open and restocked, um, so you can take advantage of that. So much love and light, Leo.